First this half hour, a new year means new voting laws in Ohio. Governor DeWine signed House Bill 458, which makes several changes, including what you must show at the polls in order to vote. Two News reporter Nisha Pettyholm explains what you need to know before you cast your next ballot here on your local election headquarters. House Bill 458 has a wide-ranging impact, most notably on early voting and a new photo ID requirement. We have to have a photo ID from everybody, and that would include um, uh, it includes your passport as well, as well as a state ID or a driver's license. Before House Bill 458, Ohio residents did not need to show photo ID. Now you won't be able to use things like utility bills, bank statements, or government checks. Uh, if you're an individual who uh, did bring in a um, a bill, a utility bill, or something like that, yeah, you will have to uh, come down uh, at some point uh, if you do not already have a photo ID. Uh, you'll be given a free one uh, through, it's my understanding, will be through uh, the BMV. So House Bill 458 passed the Ohio House along party lines 55 to 32. It creates earlier deadlines for absentee applications and ballots. There will now be just one drop box per county. The early voting schedule will change and there will be a quicker ballot turnaround. Montgomery County Board of Election Director Jeff Rosebeck says these changes will make the process smoother. It really helps us uh, with the administration of the uh, voting, uh, and so we're pleased. If you want to vote by mail using an absentee ballot, you'll have to get your application in a week prior to Election Day. The previous deadline was three days. In the studio, I'm Nisha Pettyholm, 2 News, working for you.